Welcome to Quantum Kinetics Corporation. I'm your host, the CEO, and today we're going to talk about quantum computers and how is a quantum computer the same, if not similar, to the arc reactor utilizing safe nuclear energy systems. If you're interested, go ahead and stay tuned all the way to the end of the video. A quantum computer puts the electron in a state of on and off at the exact same time, and this is called in academia quantum superposition. This is a toroflux flux representation of the electron. When the quantum computer is running properly, or the arc reactor is on properly, what happens to the electron is it turns into and phase shifts into a singularity, which means it's on and off at the exact same time, which means it can now tunnel wherever it needs to go as fast as it wants to go. When the electron is in this unique superposition state, it actually has the ability to quantum tunnel through the Coulomb barrier. And if you can figure out a way to make the electron quantum tunnel through the Coulomb barrier, you are doing safe nuclear fusion. Most quantum computers as of today, prior arc technology, you have to take the computer and freeze it down to a cryogenic state so that the electrons and all the ambient interference doesn't in influence the resonant circuits, also known as the qubits. Once you put the electron into a state of superposition, which essentially just means that you basically put the electron into a singularity state. This is a visual representation of the electron, and we have another video about that in the link description below. Go ahead and check it out. But what happens is when you have a quantum computer, the electron then phase shifts into a singularity, also known as quantum superposition. The quantum superposition state essentially means that this information over here could be transferred to this information over here literally almost instantaneously without any interruptions. As the information is being passed between computer to computer, there essentially is a quantum tunneling effect that occurs inside the reactor. And the arc reactor, which is patented, trademarked, copywritten, and research verified with the Department of Energy and also published in Nature Magazine, NPJ, Clean Water, you can actually find out that atomic transmutation occurs as the Coulomb barrier breaks down within a synthetic quantum computer. And remember, the quantum computer does one thing exceptionally well. It doesn't find the path of least resistance. It finds the fastest mode of transportation, which is not a straight line from point A to point B. It's a singularity. The irony of the quantum computer is that we are currently at this time spending hundreds of billions of dollars to create AI and also make quantum computers. But you know what the funny and ironic thing about it is? Is the quantum computer resides right between your eyes. It is your actual brain. Your brain is the ultimate quantum computer and I'll explain why. Your brain can go back in time and recoalesce the electrons in your mind to remember a memory that is long gone. Your brain can also look into the future and think about what's it going to be like at that job interview. What am I going to say? How am I going to say it? Your brain is a quantum tunneling device that can be now, in the future, or in the past. That's the amazing thing about the quantum computer is that when the electron gets put into a superposition state, it can do anything. It can be there, here, anywhere it needs to be, and you are the master of the universe. Don't let anyone else fool you. Fool you. you are potentially the most powerful creature in the universe because you are the quantum computer. Quantum Kinetics has patented, trademarked, and copywritten the arc reactor, which is the quantum computer. It puts the electron in a state of superposition, just like a quantum computer, and induces safe nuclear fusion. We can do transmutation of radioactive waste, we can do energy propulsion, you name it, we got it, we can do it. And so if you want to learn more about Quantum Connects, go ahead and visit our website at www.quantumconnects.co. If you want to learn more about plasma intelligence, go ahead and check out Dana Kippel's website at danakippel.com. And if you're a patent writer or inventor, go ahead and check out patentawards.com. They've got a fantastic selection of plaques that you are going to absolutely just love. So without further ado, thank you for your time. Thanks for tuning in. And remember, you are the quantum computer. Hey, are you an inventor that's made a patent or worked your butt off to try to get a patent? 
Well, if you have gotten a patent from the United States Patent Office, congratulations. They gave you this flimsy little book with a gold seal on it talking about your patent. That's nice and all, but there's a better way to commemorate yourself. Get yourself a custom-made plaque by patentawards.com. They have wall-mounted plaques. They have table-mounted plaques. They make pretty much anything that you could possibly imagine, and the craftsmanship is exquisite. Just look at the detail of this amazing plaque, and we have always gone with Patent Awards because they have the best customer service, they have great communication, and their prices are amazing. So if you have written the patent, go ahead and commemorate yourself by getting yourself a patent on patentawards.com. Thank <laughs> you.